how to play Who I Am by Maroon 5. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. I'll be teaching you the verse, the chorus, the pre-chorus, and the post-chorus. I'm going to start out here with the chords, so if you're already familiar with these chords, you can go ahead and skip ahead in the video. We have a C add 9, we have a G, an A minor 7, and those are the three chords you need to know. So to play a G, or to play this G, we're going to have our ring finger on the 3rd fret of the B, pinky on the 3rd fret of the high E, middle fingers on the 3rd fret of the low E, index is on the 2nd fret of the A string. To play our C add 9, you keep your ring finger and your pinky in the same spot, but you shift your middle finger down to the 3rd fret of the A, index down to the 2nd fret of the D string. So there's your C add 9, and you're just playing those 5 strings. And for an A minor 7, you're going to have your index finger on the 1st fret of the B string, middle fingers on the 2nd fret of the D. And you play those 5 strings. Alright, so now we need to figure out the strumming pattern and the chord progression. So we're going to start out on our C add 9, and this is the strumming pattern. to a G chord, same strumming pattern. Then we go to our A minor 7. Back to a G chord. So it sounds like this. We start in our C at 9. C at 9. G. Seven. Back to your G. Nice and slow. C at nine. G. A minor seven. G. And that's how you play the introduction. So the verse is the exact same. You're just gonna go C at nine. G. A minor. Back to your G. And you're gonna do that twice. In the chorus. It's actually the exact same chord progression, but we draw it out a little bit. So you're going to stay on your C at 9 for two bars instead of one. So the strumming pattern is now down, down, up, up, down, up, but you do it again. Down, down, up, up, down, up, and then you switch to your G. Down, down, up, up, down, up, A minor 7. Back to your G. twice and then you're done with the chorus. To play the post chorus we're going to be transitioning between an A minor 7 and a C at 9. And it's just one um, measure that each chord gets. So. back to the verse. So C at 9, to G, to A minor 7, to G, C at 9, G, A minor 7, to a G. And that's it. So it's the same chord progression of that C at 9 to your G, to your A minor 7, back to the G, that's the same in the verse and the chorus, but in the chorus you extend the uh, chords out a little bit, so you're staying on each chord for two measures instead of one. Um, in the post-chorus, that's the only thing that changes, you just go from A minor 7 to C add 9. And that's it. So, I taught you the verse, the chorus, and the transition between the bridge, whatever you want to call it, this A minor 7 to the C add 9. Um, I went through that pretty quickly, so if you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.